Animal Industrial Complex AIC refers to the accumulation of interests responsible for institutionalized exploitation of non-human animals. It entirely differs from individual acts of animal cruelty in that it is an institutionalized animal exploitation. Coined in 1989 by Barbara Nosk, it is one of the main topics of the critical animal studies. It is analogous to the term capitalism in human sociology. Definitions <laughs> 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 Animal industrial complex, derived from the military industrial complex of the 1950s, is a collective term used to describe the many traditions, institutions, and industries that transform animals into products and services for human consumption. It is an institutionalized violence against non-human animals that occur without any effective public opposition or government intervention. The phrase animal industrial complex was coined in 1989 by the Dutch cultural anthropologist and philosopher Barbara Nosk in her book Humans and Other Animals. In the book, she wrote, animals have become reduced to mere appendages of computers and machines. Sociologist Richard Twine later defined the concept as partly opaque and multiple set of networks and relationships between the corporate agricultural sector, governments, and public and private science. With economic, cultural, social and effective dimensions it encompasses an extensive range of practices, technologies, images, identities and markets. <inaudible> <inaudible> Origin of the complex The origin of the animal industrial complex can be traced back to antiquity when humans began domesticating animals. However, it was only since 1945 that the animal industrial complex began to grow significantly. According to Kim Stallwood, the animal industrial complex is an integral part of the neoliberal, transnational order of increasing privatization and decreasing government intervention, favoring transnational corporations and global capital." According to Sorensen, two milestones mark the shift in human attitudes toward animals that empowered the animal industrial complex, namely, Chicago and its stockyards and slaughterhouses from 1865 and the post World War II developments such as intensive factory farms, industrial fishing, and xenotransplantation. Upton Sinclair's 1906 novel The Jungle explicitly describes the mistreatment of animals during their lives until they end up at the slaughterhouse. Charles Patterson's Eternal Treblinka explains how the disassembly of animals in the slaughterhouses inspired Henry Ford's assembling of cars in factories, and how it further influenced the Third Reich in Nazi Germany in building concentration camps and gas chambers. Topic: Properties of the complex. The animal industrial complex breeds animals in the billions in order to make products and services for human consumption. All these animals are considered legal property of the animal industrial complex. The animal industrial complex is said to have transformed the already confused relationship between human and non-human animals, significantly increasing the consumption and threatening human survival. The pervasive nature of the animal industrial complex is such that it evades attention. Topic: See also Critical animal studies Animal liberation Animal rights movement Capitalism Speciesism 
equals equals citations